losing Connect everybody around me I'm a catalyst passing the energy I just wanna see everybody have a good time The weekend's here, trust me, it's time for you to rewind It's the weekend You're a boss. That's looking, what bosses do, right? I'm looking for marriage, and you're looking for a merger. I I'm not. That. I'm not looking for a merger. I'm looking for a partnership, but it got to start somewhere. Cause right now, what you're doing is you taking my time. So, time cost. Listen. It's not free. Do you know who I am? Now that I now that I look at you, yeah, you that you that radio bay, you that girl from the radio station. Hell, and you in this Honda, girl? Let me upgrade. Hey, what you, the though <laughs> i know you're thinking like what's wrong with mine my is sexy yeah 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 i know that's what the commercials say oh uh, i want you to be a walking oh. billboard oh. all right i know oh. it's uh, oh. uh car and drivers top oh. leading cop oh. but i want you to be uh top boss don't oh. you ride these streets representing me where your car at let it's, me see what you're driving it's getting shipped here right now oh it's getting shipped it's getting shipped there i just got in from uh. Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? Welcome to Sand Tech, man. My name is Jay Sand, coming back with another one, man. Look, in that clip, right? You got this female, right? And guess what? She treated that dude exactly like how a modern day female would treat a thirsty beta male. You know what I'm saying? She treated him like the beta male that he is, the beta male that he acted like, you know, he approached her, cold approached her at that, you know, he kind of disrespected her by, you know, down, downgrading her, talking about her car and how she's supposed to be winning. And if she was with him, a boss, then she would be riding in a Bentley. You know what I'm saying? She'd be riding in a Bentley and shit like that. Telling her pretty much that she ain't winning. If she was with him, though, she'd be winning. And he talking about how he don't usually do this. And, you know, he a boss, this and that. You know what I mean? And she treated him how these modern day females would treat a beta male that approach a woman, a woman in that manner. You know, you approach her. You acting like you a boss. You saying she ain't winning. You know what I mean? You talking about her car like her, like... Like her car and her life ain't nothing. But if she was to be with him, she'd really be noticed. He'd boss her up. He'd upgrade her. So you know what she hit him with? Well, let me send you my cash app then and see what you drop in there. You know what I mean? And then I give you my number. She acted, right? She acted like most of these modern day females act. Real talk. But he approached her. Just like most of these beta males approach these women. How most of these dudes approach these women and they think that that's the way to go. Acting like you a boss. Acting like you got money. You know what I'm saying? So she acted like most of these women act these days. You know what I'm saying? This ain't a video against her. It's more of a video against him and his approach. You know what I'm saying? Because... How she acted is expected these days. You got a lot of women like that, but you can't blame her when she the one that's getting approached with the nonsense that he kicked to her. She the one that's getting approached by this beta male that want to use money to try to get her. So off top, he treating her like a thought. He treating her like a sack chaser. So guess what? That's what she acted and that's how she acted like. That's what she acted like. You know what I mean? You want to come to her. You want to disrespect her, her car, and tell her that you want to boss her up, talking about you a boss. Come on. Now, which one of y'all that listened to that and watched that clip they think that that shit was player? Because it really ain't. It really ain't. You know, you cold approaching her, which me, I'm against cold approaching her. Most, most of y'all are going to say, well, you know what I mean? If you want something, you should go get it. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Whatever. You know what I'm saying? But if you a true boss, like you say, then guess what? These females will be sending super choosing signals. If you listen, if because obviously a boss, right? A boss is a high value man. You know what I'm saying? Most females will peep that 
in your appearance, how you carry yourself. Hell, what car you getting into? A boss ain't approaching no women like that. A boss is not going to cold approach a female like that because he not thirsty like that. He on this grind most of the time, but if it, if a if a female step to a boss, then guess what? A boss might just give her a chance. But usually a boss just, you know what I mean? He on this grind and he got pickings of the litter. So a boss really just a chick off the street that's just, you know what I mean? That's approaching a man. Listen, he probably already got a stable. That's what real bosses have. You know what I'm saying? So it's highly unlikely that a boss is going to, a real boss is going to run up on a female knocking at her car door, knocking on her car window because she see him coming. She see him coming. Do you think that she looked at him and was like, yeah, this is a boss? No. She looked at him and treated him like the beta male that she saw him as, like the beta male that he proved he was in his approach. In his approach, his whole approach was wrong. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no real boss doing that. Ain't no real masculine man running up on no female like that and saying those things. You know what I'm saying? No real masculine man is going to run up on a female and say those type of things. And listen, man, when you masculine out here, when you high value out here, when you a real boss out here, you ain't doing that. You're not engaging in that type of uh, activity because you're going to carry yourself like a boss. You're going to carry yourself like the king that you are. And I want y'all to understand that as well. That type of activity, that's the same shit that you see mugs doing in a club. That's the same shit you do. You see thirsty dudes doing. That's the same shit you see these beta males doing. You don't do that. You don't do that. I don't care what you... And that's what I say. It's a lot. That's another term that's getting tossed around like I told y'all about king and queen and real nigga and this and that. Listen, come on, man. That's another thing. That's another thing. Now everybody bosses. You a boss, but you not acting like one. You don't carry yourself like one. You throwing money around. You acting like you big, you big shit Rick. You know what I'm saying? You acting like you big shit Rick. You downplaying her ride and, and, and acting like you know her. Listen, that was disrespectful. You know, I had you in this and that and how she treat him. She treat him like a lot. I got to I got to I got to talk about it. Y'all seen the clip. She treated him like most of these modern day females. That's how they think. That's how they think. But real talk, do you think that she would have said that to a real dude, like a, a high value dude that she sought after? Nah, she wouldn't have treated him like that. She wouldn't have said nothing about no cash app. None of that. She wouldn't have said, let me give you my cash app and then see, let's see if you could do this or that. She wouldn't have treated a real masculine dude that she liked and really, you know, was interested in. She wouldn't have treated him like that. But she treated that beta male like that. You know what I'm saying? Because look how he approached her. He using boss like he like he like he a boss and money. He throwing money in her face, you know, telling her what he'd do and up how he upgraded her. So that's what that's what she gonna gravitate to. She gonna treat him just like that. He the one brought that out of her, but she not going to treat no real dude like that. She not going to come at a true masculine man like that. She won't. Females won't. Now, I'm not saying just because she wouldn't show her cars like that, that, that doesn't mean that that's not something that she think about. All females going to think about money. All females going, you know what I mean? Hypergamy is real. You know what I mean? She going to, women going to always gravitate to the dude. That's high value that look like he got more money. You know what I'm saying? Because in her mind, that's more security for her. That's a security blanket. You know what I'm saying? That's stability for her. So she going to always see she the women going to always choose the dude that got the bread. You know what I'm saying? But when it come to cats like that, listen, man, that is what you don't do. That's a lesson for y'all. Even if you got money and you got you doing good in life and you really bossing up out here, you don't approach women like that. You don't approach women like that because guess what? They're going to use you. All you do is open yourself up to be used because you using your money and your status 
to draw her in, to bring her in. That ain't, that ain't nothing player about that. That's not you using your personality, right? You know, using, you know what I mean? Your masculinity and none of that. That's not, that's not, listen, that your energy and your masculinity going to draw in the woman itself. That, that, that type of energy will bring her in. But when you when you put money, when you involve money and acting like you something that you're not, bro, listen, that ain't going to work. And all that is going to do is just open yourself up to be used and abused. How you approach her, that's how she going to use you, dog, because you use you trying to use that to get her. So she going to use you for all of that. Yeah, you got that money, that status. OK, here go my cash app. Go ahead. Drop it in since you so generous. But a lot of these women think exactly like her. They, a lot of these women going to come at him exactly like her. A lot of these women got the same mindset. But guess what? Yeah, not towards a masculine dude. Not towards a dude that have respect for himself. More respect. Listen, you and you ain't. Listen, man, before, before I go, you don't have to have money to carry yourself in a certain manner. You know what I mean? You don't have to have money. You don't have to be high value and have a bank account and actually be a boss to carry yourself like one. You know what I mean? It doesn't take all of that extra shit. All you got to do is have respect for yourself and have that masculine energy. And that dude that don't got that money, you just because you carry yourself like you a boss. You know what I'm saying? And have respect for yourself and have that masculine energy. She'll give it up quicker to you than she would give it to that clown. Because you you more real. You more real. You not using no status to get her. Listen, that intrigues women. Women like mystery. How many times I got to tell y'all that? They like mystery. They like that dude that they not sure about and, and not as flashy and just got that masculine energy holding that masculine frame. They love that shit. That's not looking at them. They like the dude that's not paying attention to them. That's not looking like the clown on that clown shit like you heard, old boy. They like that dude. They like that dude. That dude right there, he on his grind grind. He not trying to do nothing. He ain't thirsty. He not chasing. He not cold approaching. He just worried about himself. He got that masculine energy. His looks on point. He carry himself like a king. That's where it's at. Not where do that. That ain't the way to go. So I want y'all to remember that. You ain't got to have a bread and actually have all of these things like he fronting like he got to get the female. All you got to do is be solid. All you got to do is have that masculine energy, just that masculine frame and really be taking care of yourself and show your self-love. When you got that self-love, females notice that. That clown shit, listen, you just going to get treated like a clown. You know what I mean? You play stupid games, you win stupid prizes, bruh. And that is real. So remember that moving forward, all right? And that's my word, man. My name is Jason and CN Take. Holla at y'all later, man. Peace. First, I'ma get on my grind. Then, second, stop wasting my time. Uh, on shit less important. If ain't about money, I'm going the other direction. And third, I'ma do what I got it to eat. Fourth, I'ma sew up the streets. Fifth, I'ma never quit dropping this heat. So, as long as I'm breathing, you better get used to me. Sixth, I'ma get.